Um, how can church planners get stuff done when they don't have a lot of money? Uh, so they can still do a lot of stuff without any money. Um, so most ministry, biblically speaking, is free ministry. Um, that's everything from prayer to studying the word, to sharing the word, to discipling people. Uh, whatever they're going to need to do to take care of their own needs, they can still do that. And that was Paul's boast that these hands had ministered to his own needs and those who were with him. Uh, so they can always not be in the pay of a church and still get much ministry done. Uh, within that context, though, there needs to be just a very large uh, firm confidence in who God is and the fact that God is for them. So Hebrews 13, five says to keep yourself free from the love of money. And that may not be just, you know, greedily trying to pursue more and more, but it could be an inordinate affection and a confidence in the money that you will acquire. Uh, so keep your life free from that and be content with what God gives you. Be content with what you have, knowing that the Lord has promised he'll never leave you or forsake you and that he's your helper. So the first thing a planner needs to do when they don't have any money is to pray and pray for a heart that trusts God and ask God for the stuff that they need. And if he doesn't give it to them, they need to not complain about what he doesn't give them, uh, but to use what he does provide, be that time, opportunity, or whatever limited resources they do have to bring God the most glory that they can uh, according to their ability. Um, and God hasn't abandoned them. Uh, you know, know that he doesn't expect uh, from you what he has not given you to steward. So if he's given you one talent, he is not expecting you to bring back what the man with five talents brought back. Um, he's expecting you to be faithful with little if he's given you little. Um, and at the end of the day, the confidence is in not what we have, but who we know. And I said, we know the Lord God Almighty who owns all things. And if he wants to give it, he will. If he wants to withhold it, he will. But whatever he does provide, he's good in it. Uh, we're not deficient. We're not uh, kept from anything that's good for us. He doesn't withhold anything good from those who walk uprightly. And so a church planner should know whatever he does have, it's exactly what God wants him to have.